ensuring a safe delivery of bitumen. Safe delivery of bitumen by road tanker. With a device to vent from the ground, Eurobitume promotes good operational, safety and environmental practices. We'll follow Jacqueline, a bitumen tanker driver, during a delivery into a customer storage tank. We'll detail all the recommended procedures to ensure safe delivery of the product. Bitumen is a product that is delivered hot, up to 230 degrees centigrade and sometimes under pressure. Extreme caution is required to minimize the risk of burns or other injuries associated with the delivery process. The tanker used for this delivery is equipped with a vent which can be operated from ground level. This equipment eliminates the need for the driver to climb onto the tanker and therefore eliminates the risk of the driver falling off the tanker and avoids the driver being exposed to bitumen fumes when the man lid is opened. The driver arrives at the customer's site and has a safety induction to ensure that she understands the safety rules enforced on the site. She drives onto the weigh bridge to weigh the delivery tanker, then positions the tanker onto the unloading area, applies the parking brake and stops the engine. She enters information on the bitumen being delivered into the onboard computer and completes the transport documentation. The driver exits the vehicle safely, ensuring that she always maintains three points of contact and then equips herself with all the necessary personal protective equipment, often referred to as PPE. This includes a protective overall, high safety shoes, a helmet with an integral visor, chin strap and neck apron, and gloves specifically designed for protection whilst handling hot products. She cuts the power supply, then chucks the wheels, locks the vehicle and then reports to the customer's supervisor. She presents the supervisor with the delivery documents and asks him to confirm the correct grade is being delivered, the storage tank into which the delivery is going to be made and that it has sufficient urge for the quantity of bitumen being delivered. The driver grounds the tanker assembly and locates the alarm and the emergency assembly points. The driver checks the location and operation of the safety shower. If the shower is missing or out of order, the delivery must not take place and the customer and the company delivering the bitumen must be notified. The driver checks the closure of the bottom valve and the safety valve and vents the tanker from ground level. This device means that the driver doesn't need to climb onto the delivery tanker to open the man lid. This eliminates the risk of falls from the top of the tank and exposure to bitumen fumes, especially H2S. H2S is a gas that can be emitted from hot bitumen. H2S is an irritant, toxic and can cause nausea and unconsciousness and could result in fatality. She operates the button to open the tank vent. She ensures that the light in the box turns green and that the piston stopping the operation of the bottom valve has been withdrawn. The driver checks that the hose and seals are in good condition. She removes the cap from the tanker outlet valve, connects the hose onto the delivery tanker, checks the condition of the customer seal and connects the hose onto the customer's pipework. The customer representative at the delivery site starts the ground-based suction pump. The driver opens the safety valve and then the bottom valve, ensuring that there are no bitumen leaks. She must continuously monitor the bitumen discharge. If there is a leak, stop the discharge. Close the bottom valve and then the safety valve, open the air perch to drain the hose and switch off the customer's pump before tightening the fittings. Follow this procedure to avoid accidents and spillages. The customer's pump is still running, the driver closes the bottom valve and then opens it again several times to completely empty the tanker. She closes the bottom valve and then the safety valve. She opens the tank air vent, 
disconnects the hose on the tanker side and drains the hose at the customer's premises into a suitable receptacle. The driver cleans the connections, closes the customer's tank connection and the customer stops the pump. She then cleans the tanker outlet valve and puts the cap back on, closes the air vent. The driver secures the hose onto the tanker. She operates the button to close the tanker air vent, thereby avoiding the need to climb onto the tanker again. She ensures that the light turns red and that the bottom valve hand wheel is locked by the piston. She removes the earth connection. She removes the chocks and returns to the weigh bridge. By calculating the difference between the weight on entry and the weight on exit, she can be sure that her tanker is empty because she knows the weight of the empty unit. She receives the signed and stamped transport documents and can leave in complete safety. Eurobitum recommends that all haulers equip all bitumen tankers with ground venting to improve the safety of drivers and operators when delivering bitumen. The guide to the safe bitumen delivery can be downloaded from the Eurobitum website under publications HSE documents.